Alright, so for Kobe Skip, there are a few things to keep in mind. One is your uh, smart camera needs to be turned to off because we are setting up the camera at a specific angle, and if the camera is allowed to move on its own, then it's going to throw everything off. So make sure this is off, and then from there, there are three things we need to keep that we are going to be doing for this setup. First is we're getting a specific camera angle, second is we're getting a specific position, and then third, we are going to need specific bash timing. So, and by doing this setup, this will help us narrow down where we're making any mistakes when actually doing attempts. So, for the camera angle, we're going to point the camera down like this, so I'm looking down at Spongebob, just as far up as you can possibly get it, and then we're going to attempt to make a straight line with Spongebob and these two dots. And now th for this part I would recommend having some kind of marker on the top of your monitor to help you get these perfectly in line. I have a like integrated laptop webcam on the top of my monitor and so I can kind of line these up almost perfectly since they're just about the same shape of circles. So I get these two circles about in a, about as straight as I can get them. It doesn't need to be 100% perfect, but as close as you can get it. And then we are going to get the position that we want. So for this part, you want to practice this beforehand to make sure your position is about correct. Um, because when you're, when you're actually doing attempts, you only have about seven seconds to run over here before the ball reaches here, and that's not enough time if it's your first try. And so, where we about want to stand is, if you see these smudges on the ground, um, we kind of want to stand about about right here on them. Um, that's kind of the visual marker I was using originally, but if you need something else to help you, if you kind of face towards the underwear off in the distance here, and keep your body parallel with these, the seam of this metal, so I'm kind of like, my body is like perfectly in line with it right here. And then if I move over here, I'm perfectly parallel with it. Just about. It doesn't need to, that part doesn't need to be perfect, but it helps get you more consistent in the spot. And now if you're too far to the right, like so, the camera's going to zoom in like this. That means your positioning isn't quite right. Um, so you want to move over just to the left a little bit. Uh, if you care about which way you're facing, you can spin and that'll let you move without turning yourself. So we want to be right about here, parallel with that seam of metal facing the underwear and the camera is not zoomed in. So right about here, then we want to run back to this. And then the last part we have to worry about is the bash timing, but we'll do that in actual runs. So, well, here, never mind, let me explain it. So when we're doing the bash, we're going to be positioned right about here, and what's going to happen is the marble is going to roll down the ramp, and as it comes over top of us, it's going to cause the camera to zoom in due to it obstructing the camera. And when it does that, you have maybe like two or three frames to input your bash and to launch it over to the glass tube. So, um, yeah. So we're going to attempt to do that real quick. Running over here, marble's coming down. Camera zoomed in, not quite right. There we go. Alright, that was too late. That's gonna go off into the abyss. I'm not even gonna look at it. And remember not to turn while you're bubble bowling, or that'll mess up your angle and ruin the trick. That was too early. You have to do it right as it zooms in. So it's not really something that you can react to. You just have to know the timing and then press it right as it happens. That was, I don't know, I don't know which timing was wrong there, but it was probably positioning. That was way too early, and that's going to go off into La La Land. Probably. Where did that go? Oh, it's... Oh, it almost worked, but... Yeah. 
It'll despawn here in a second. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so let's get the camera set back up. That's about right. Camera is not zoomed in, almost parallel. That was way too early because I got antsy. Alright, that's it. That's going in. Alright, so this trick is probably not liable for speedruns right yet, but it'll help you. This, tr this setup will help you determine where you're messing up and narrow down uh, what you need to work on. So, yeah.